to their arm. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Ah! You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside. Get the lube. Actually, fuck the lube. Who the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me the station, Chief. I'm not finished. 36 flow. I got you. Don't harm the asset. There's another shooter. Oh, God. Oh, God. What's happening? Don't shoot me! Shit! Oh, shit! Wait! We got a window, T! Pull us out! This is unacceptable! No! Shooters across the street! Don't, don't trap me! Don't, don't trap me! Relax! Scout on! We need the asset in that! T! We need to be... Clear this building! Shit! The guy's shooting at you, Mikey! That's unfinished business! Clean it up! You know that? Whoa. That's it. Get us out of here. Roger that. Whoa. Whoa. Looks like we've attracted the attention of their air unit. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin. I thought I had the easy job. Okay? I'm sure. Don't worry. They'll look after you. The things those people did to me. I'm an American citizen. Put her down in the lot, Trevor. It easy. Oh, oh, come on, give the guy oh. a break. Uh. I'm gonna get out of this shit. Ha <laughs> ha! In bed with the bureau. 
And a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, uh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Jerry, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you've turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? 
No, I think she said whore monitoring ass wipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yes, she's very centered. A regular you oasis see what of I peace and tranquility, this with one. with anger issues and worse friends. No you're, wonder I'm so upset. You too, please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, no. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, Miguel, come. Awesome. So, Fab, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubt. So why is she driving a tank on hers? Perhaps to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the moribunda. The asshole. Now we begin and put the asshole to the earth. Yes? We begin each sequence. Tadasana. Yes. Or mountain pole. Alright. Un, deux, trois. Mouth and anus are perfectly in line. Show him, Amanda. Un, deux, trois. It is perfect. Now, Michael. Through the bloated nose and out through those wrinkled lips. Very good. Now let it go. There. Strong. Like an erection of your youth. Air through the nose and out the mouth. Who would have thought it possible? In and out with the breath, Mikhail. Let it go. It's like watching one of my kids take their first steps. Only an old version I resent. This is gonna have to do. Now we will do something more complicated. Sometimes when I do this pose, I weep uncontrollably for hours. Wow. <laughs> you feel that? The emotion inside? Let it go. <laughs> Michael, join us. I feel like I'm channeling bullshit right now. Now, you breathe. Let it out, baby. There. There it is. You can breathe, can't you? Keep it tight. The silly man forgets to breathe. This is still pretty basic. You embarrass yourself. But we do not care. Again. Breathe, Mikkel. Out with the breath. There! Let it go! Now, you breathe. You feel that? You can breathe, can't you? Let it out. Tight! Tighter! The silly man forgets to breathe. Out through those wrinkled lips. Yeah, I'm about to feel some emotions, all right. Remember, children, do not fear the unknown. We are the unknown. Show us, Amanda. I don't think Michael's up to this. Hmm. He may surprise you. Plank. Plank. Chaturanga. Chata. Yeah. 
Feel the flow. Everything is flowing in me. Mike, would you? Put the Luna to the face. Take in the air and release it. Out through the mouth. When we met, he was actually limber. Breeze, please, Michael. Hold the anus. Your lungs, they work, yes? Oh, you gotta start braiding those armpits, Amanda. This is not how it is done. A sliver of enlightenment is not far away. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Lengthen, strengthen, take in the air and release it. Out through the mouth. If it's too much, just go into child's pose. Breathe, please, Michael. The end is in sight. Just hold it together. Be present, please. Your lungs, they work, yes? Exhale. Not bad. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? You're sweaty, Michael. That's all the impurities coming out. Take in the air and release it. Breathe out, please. If you'd found yoga before, you wouldn't have been that way with Coach. Breathe, please, Michael. Isn't this better than robbing, murdering, and being an asswipe? Your lungs, they work, yes? Let it out. You're turning red. This is what I was talking about. Can't you see how blocked he is? Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? No vanity. Come on. Take in the air and release it. Out with the breath. Fabian's body with your bank account would be the perfect man. <laughs> you have come a long way today, Mikael. Huh? Yes, later you will cry like a baby. Yeah, right. His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Show me the downward dog. I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Back into my pelvis. Back. What? Back, back. Yes, there you go. Oh, 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 oh! What? Hey, enough of that! Shit. Ah. Ah. Yoga is the answer, Mikael. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving and we are never coming back! Good! You are alone, you pathetic psychopath! Ugh, fuck you! And that phony French fucking yogi! Ah! Jimmy, you still here? James! Leave me alone! Oh, yeah. Fuck you. You know what? If there was a rape button, I'd be using it right now. Unless you're a faggot and you like that sort of shit. And then I'll just rape your mom instead. I'm talking in your ear, soldier. Nice Open TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? All right, come on. I want to go for a ride. I got to meet a friend. All right, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit! Bullshit? Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies! 
They're the only people you speak to. So where's your friend? Burger shot? Yeah, nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guys, we'd go down to the diner after class every day. You know, get milkshakes, fries. Ew, please. You know, you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No, you're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope-smoking, game-playing, live-at-home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it! I knew it! The mask was gonna slip! The monster's been exposed! The hell are you talking about? The real you! That bitter, vindictive old man! You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim! How many times... I love you! Look, I'm sorry if I don't express that correctly. Why do you think we're here together? Because you're scared shitless of being alone? Oh, now you're an armchair psychologist. Just like the rest of this city. You really have to meet my friend? Yeah, I really do. Then please don't get weird. For once in your life, don't be weird. There he is, the friendly neighborhood drug dealer. <laughs> Yo, oh, bro, man, what's man? up? How what's are you up, doing? man? Good to see you. What are you turning tricks to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy pot by the pound? Mm. <laughs> ah, Jimmy, bro, your dad's funny, man. Come on, do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck? Jimmy, just, just hold on a second. Oh, all right, all right, later on. Careful with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. Is that what we're doing? Jesus fucking Christ. All righty then. Now what? Can we just get back to the house, please? Oh, so now... So, uh, want a drink? I'm driving. Because normally you're such a between-the-white-lines, friend-to-the-pedestrian kind of guy. Fine. Give it here. Okay, your turn. Maybe when we get home. Ah, who's the square now? Yes, no, no. <laughs> no, not I'm starting to feel a little woozy. You're fine. No. Really, this is not Chill normal. Chill out. You're just paranoid. This is not paranoia. This is totally justified <laughs> concern. You should see yourself. Whoa. Serious. Whoa. I gotta pull over. Oh, who's in there? It's harmless. Vets have been using it for decades. What? You anesthetize me? You fucking shit. I'm protecting you from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving out. What? All right? You're too crazy, Dad. Goodbye. Jimmy! Yeah. <laughs> 
Jimmy, you little shit. Michael, I think you finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who is a close friend, and then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. Well, we've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. put down for 10 seconds it's free game bud Who the fuck is this? The guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Shit, man. Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly, and look at me. Boom! Best shape of my life. Yeah. 
Yeah, I could still take you, sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged, not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick doing fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? Hey, fuck you. You know, I'm beginning to think that's exactly what you want to do. Yeah. Jesus. Just said the same fucking thing to my wife. Did you see his face that last time I popped him? <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> It reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> you, hmm. where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the sleep out of the way from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. I don't, I don't know anything. I don't know, I already told nothing, nothing, I don't know anything. Please, please, sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. You know? So, You're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. What did you tell them? And what did they tell you? I, I, told, hmm? them, I told them what I tell you. Uh-huh. What? I. Hey! This whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You I two are told... gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 no. Because no, I'm tired no. of these fucking nitwits no, at the agency no. taking all the glory. Let me go. All right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. No, you get to work, and uh, I'm not here. The guy's your neighbor, Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. The more I see of your boss, the more I like him. If I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent 10 years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you, 
you remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Town. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. This is bullshit. This place? Davey, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Cut. Uh, hey, you want a coffee? Can I get you anything? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Uh, wait. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh? Dentistry is an industry that hasn't advanced in the last hundred years. Still a bunch of sadomasochists. I just have them laser! Are they still alive? Stop him being able to talk. That hurts too much. <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. What didn't you ask me? I know it's here. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in too much. The ride on the Western Highway. Well, that wasn't so tough, was it? <laughs> Huh? Oh. <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that town than they needed. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainees write them. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was doing you a favor. Didn't think you'd want to know he was in the same state. This'll do. All right. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. No, no, please. I tell what? you what Loosen you him up. No, no, please. The anticipation is always worse. Really? <laughs> you can't. Come! 
Dead arm. Hey, 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 hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I'm ready to talk. I got to give now. That's what we were afraid of. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy we're after, what does he look like? I was built. I was like middle age. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark, okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. What's one look like? They look Eastern. Half this town looks Eastern, Davey. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. That ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit. I, let me think. I remember. Ah! Oh, Sorry, too no. late. Trevor, show our contestant what he's won today. I remember. Oh, okay. I remember. I remember. Woo! Sparky, Sparky. Not the clip. Not the clip. I will die. Oh, you will kill me. No. I think he's getting a stiffy. So what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 He's got beer. He's got beer. He's got beer. Uh-huh. I think you're making this up. No, no, I'm not. Huh? No. Yeah? I'm telling the truth. Bushy beard? Got any beardy types at this party? Huh? Because that's all Mr. K's given us. No. You know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our informants and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific or is some stubble gonna cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Ah, there's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Jumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. It's gonna be a long day until you give us some intel on our target. This is a mental battle, my brother. You gotta convince yourself you're not gonna drown. It's a torture! No! I will drown! Say this! Oh no! It's all in your head, Ferdinand! Stop it! It's done the trick! Yep, he comes! Well, that's what happens when you put the body through the ringer. Here goes! How long was I out? <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, please. <laughs> okay. He chain smoked. And he's left handed. What's that? He changed smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. <laughs> Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's telling me he chain smokes Redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and 
He's left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest's detailed. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. Well, as good as you can get with it. What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've... Got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now, I got a racquetball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <laughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> let's go, come on. Wait a second, me too. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on. Up the fucking stairs. Oh, fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. Now you got a flight to catch. Okay? Let's get you to the air. Oh, safety first. How's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you gonna hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me with you. Jesus Christ, good grief. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm having my doubts. Departures! No one drives me to the airport. I'm trying real hard. Here we be. Ugh. Run! You're free! Oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, alright? And look, trust no one, alright? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on.
good as new. This is Army Grade Limited Edition. All about making a statement. You'll really notice the difference with that. That is fresh to death. for all the family. That's a boost in the hand. I'm not kidding. All dressed up and nowhere to go.
You'd need a rocket launcher to put a flat in those. <laughs> 